Hi, this is Dr. Newhouse with explainthepain.com. I want to talk to you about tarsal tunnel syndrome. Unusual name. Most of you have heard about carpal tunnel syndrome, problem that affects the wrist, an overuse syndrome of the wrists. It affects the nerves in the wrists. It affects the, the nerves in the ankles. The tarsal bones are the small bones of the foot, just like the carpal bones are the small bones of the hand. So tarsal tunnel syndrome actually affects the ankle area, but it affects the nerve that goes around the ankle that supplies feeling to the bottom of the foot. It's called the tibial nerve. Now this nerve, as it courses around the ankle bone, uh, there's some tight structures that hold it in place as it's curved in that corner. Those structures can become uh, overly tight, or you get inflammation in one of the structures, or actually inflammation in the nerve itself. It's typically though an entrapment problem where you get scar tissue, you get something in flame that's putting pressure on the nerve. When you get pressure on the nerve, you get burning pain in the bottom of the foot or the heel. Uh, there's a branch of the nerve that comes down at, around the ankle, shoots down onto the bottom of the heel. This can cause symptoms that are very similar to uh, those experienced with plantar fasciitis. And there are cases where people are treated for plantar fasciitis when really they have a tarsal tunnel syndrome. So if you have a burning pain in the heel, sharp shooting pains down into the arch or into the heel, uh, you may very well have tarsal tunnel syndrome. Um, some of the things that can be done to treat this, uh, using a good orthotic to take pressure off of the inside of the ankle, supporting the arch so you don't roll in as much when you walk. If you're not rolling in, you're not putting that strain on the nerve, and that can sometimes allow that to heal up. Stretching, um, icing will also help that. Some anti-inflammatory medications like ibuprofen or prescription strength medicines your doctor might prescribe for you can also be helpful. And there are cases where people do need to have tarsal tunnel surgery, where you actually go in and release the nerve and the nerve branches just like they do for carpal tunnel syndrome. Um, I would recommend as much conservative treatment with uh, a nerve-related issue like tarsal tunnel syndrome as possible. Um, there certainly are um, uh, some products that we have on the website that can be beneficial for that, such as night splints, uh, orthotics, such as the power step. I would start with things like this and see how you do. Um, but this is one of those conditions that if, it's, uh, if there's any doubt, you need to get this diagnosed. Uh, you need to see your doctor because uh, you may very well need a surgical procedure or some aggressive physical therapy or something else that, uh, that your doctor may do for you. But that's what tarsal tunnel syndrome is. I hope this helps explain um, what that's all about and uh, answers your questions. Thanks for visiting the website at explainthepain.com.